Hi Virgo, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Virgo, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Virgo. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Five of Swords in the reverse, and this is air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. So in the reverse, this is an energy of avoiding conflict or putting an end to conflict. Someone could be calling a truce or wanting to make amends. This is someone who's putting their pride and ego aside, and they, they, they want harmony in this connection. So let's see. We have the Magician, Mercury energy, the Two of Swords, air energy, and the Six of Cups water energy so it could be an ex that's coming back you know it looks like an ex who's apologetic someone who you ended things on a bit of a bad note with they are missing you they've been feeling very nostalgic and they are reminiscing about the good times and they really want to make things right with the two of swords you may not trust this person though you may be a bit closed off you may have even blocked them or you've shut them out you've got like a bit of a wall up against them you may you may just not really trust this person because of that five of swords energy but this person is going to try to impress you they're going to try to take control of the situation let's clarify these cards we have the ten of swords and this is air energy gemini libra aquarius energy so there is again that energy of this person hurt you like the way things ended was very noticeable like it was painful uh with the ten of swords this could have even been a betrayal you know it's like you may have really lost trust in this person because of how things ended let's see we have the seven of wands fire energy the page of swords air energy and we have the seven of pentacles earth energy so this person is going to fight for you they're going to try to make things right this person never forgot about you with the with the page of swords they actually keep tabs on you they think about you a lot they watch you they look at your social media they ask friends about you this is someone who you know they've really been wanting to communicate and it looks like they're gaining the courage to do it but this is something that they've been contemplating for a long time they think a lot about how much they already invested in the connection with you or just your your shared history and they really do miss you okay so i'm gonna pull out an article card for you okay we have communication is key new moon and gemini so this person really wants you to hear them out they may have a lot they want to say to you Okay, we have reconciliation someone from your past is returning to your life so there is again that energy an ex coming back uh wanting to work it out wanting to talk to you wanting to reconcile let's see Okay, we have always joyful write it on your heart that every day is the best day of the year so this person really is trying to focus on the positive like the, the more positive memories that you guys share they may also see you as someone who when you were in their life they were happier you know they felt almost like you had some sort of healing presence or you added a lot of value to their life when you were in it okay so i'm gonna pull out a card for your advice virgo
Okay, we have surrender your fear of intimacy. You are ready to let love in. Compassionately identify and begin to release any patterns that stop you from opening your heart. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Virgo. I hope you have a really, really good day, Virgo. Bye, Virgo.